kidding me? <laughs> Just hit me some more, you f***ing No f it. I just f***ing got done with the f***ing accident report. What the f***? What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. I just f***ing got done with the f***ing accident report. Drivers, is that the reason why you guys don't like parking at the truck stop sometimes? In these clips right here, we're going to be looking at two drivers. One is a female and the other one is a male. They was both in truck stop crashes uh, with the one being hit twice by two different trucks in the same truck stop parking lot. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Are you kidding me? What is he doing? Just hit me some more, you f God damn it! Jesus f Christ! I can't even get loaded in a dock! I can't get even loaded in a dock! Jesus f Christ! You got three f mirrors on that thing! One, two, three! Fuck up my fucking shoe! You can't look in your mirror! Look at what you did to my truck! Do you speak English? Do you speak English? Look at it. He's got my steer tire, my brand new fucking steer tire! Oh my fucking god, are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. Oh. Yeah, I would just take your pictures. I swear to god. If this week cannot get any fucking worse than it already fucking is, this is just, it, this just blows my fucking mind, guys. This just blows my mind what type of fucking people have a CDO. Stupid motherfucker. Yeah, man, with the Michael bitch. Yeah, man, with the Michael bitch. With the yeah, man. But, God. No fucking. Fucking shit! I just fucking got done with the fucking accident report. What the fuck is wrong with you fucking drivers? You stupid motherfuckers, man! Don't fucking move. Let me call the cops. Jesus fucking Christ! You guys don't know how to fucking drive, man! You fucking motherfuckers! Yeah, man, my boga. What the fuck is this, man? What is this? Shit? So drivers, there you have it. Mm, mm, mm. Both of them popping their lids that night. Got super upset because of what happened. And it's probably might be, you know, probably might be understandable. But just like what the commenters have said, why, why get upset? All you have to do is just get their information. That's what insurance is for. But in the case of gear grinding situation, she mentioned something to the fact that that particular company that hit her didn't have insurance in fact the insurance lapsed on the company so are here where are they going where, where are you guys going now that you know the cops are here are you not supposed to be in that truck their insurance is expired they did not want the cops involved they're like we don't want to involve the cops and the second someone says we don't want to involve the cops you better involve the cops um they kept trying to bribe me with money to do this without insurance or cops um thousands of dollars and i'm like look it's not my truck i don't have any control over it um the cop is here now my poor truck i don't even know what to say at this point like there was five men minimum in that truck and three of them just took off just walked we don't know where they went they're gone and apparently they never existed according to these guys now um they're gone i got them on video but they, they don't exist um the cops here right now dealing with them like seriously the cops dealing with them right now you know she says she deals with shit like this all the time where there'll be a shitload of men in these trucks so yeah um I don't know what to do. I, I, 
I don't understand what happened. One minute, it's one man in the truck that hit me and I'm dealing with him. And the next minute, when the cops are going to be involved, it's like a clown car and they're all just climbing out. And now three of them have just, they're gone. They don't exist anymore. According to these guys, they were never there. Um, How are they driving? I do not know. But another crazy thing is she mentioned the fact that it was five people in that truck with three of them walking away that is crazy right there that is crazy like whoop okay well police is coming we don't need to be around for that situation right there <laughs> man that's crazy i mean drivers like seriously be careful you know i always talk about how drivers be in the in in the seat they break out the camera and they be recording other drivers struggles look how this man is looking at this woman <laughs> oh my goodness because she is mad close to his truck and really she just pulled straight instead of going out to arch her truck to be able to back in that spot he is watching like a hog this is hilarious now if she she gonna have to like ease up some look at him <laughs> what if i was her what i would do i would pull the fuck up dude like yeah there you go like that Y'all, this man has watched to this lady pull all the way in. I kid you not. <laughs> Instead of just getting out and and help, or just getting out and just making sure that you know that their trucks won't get hit. Now, in the case of gear grinding hyena maybe she was in the cab watching and everything you know because she did start to record after the fact we did not know before the fact what she was doing but that's here nor there that's here nor there you know after the fact it already happened but you know as being a company driver things happen you know, the, the, the truck is not yours. So just, you know, get out, get the information needed from that driver, take some pictures, send it into your company. If your truck can still move, you can, you know, take it to get it repaired. If not, of course, it's going to, you know, somebody going to need to come and get you. It's going to, you know, kind of take some of the time away or whatever whatever depending on what company you drive for in the case of the other driver though dude got got twice in one night now in his thing he said he wasn't there uh when his truck got hit uh the first time but when he came back to assess the situation he just happened to know that the other truck while he was there clipped him <laughs> so so yeah things like that happen in truck stops and i know a lot of you drivers don't like parking in truck stops sorely for that reason you know because you got a lot of inexperienced drivers that's coming in late at night tired as what as all get out and they trying to get up in the only parking spot that's available and they have to do some crazy maneuvers you know they probably might not got out and look they probably might not assess their situation but if you're a driver and you see drivers that get in situations like that instead of just breaking out your phone and try to record their struggles hop out and help all right that's all a little bit of courtesy goes a long way especially if you don't want nobody to hit your truck if you see somebody that's coming a little bit close to it wouldn't you jump out your truck and be like hey bro hold on hold on wouldn't you do that drivers let me know what you would do in any situations like that would you get out and help 
or would you break out your phone and record and let somebody hit your your truck let me know in the comments below